Okay guys, it's me Imad from Nelson Darwin Park Tech YouTube channel. So in this video tutorial, we will learn that how we can make a Knight Rider or a running LED project within the Proteus by using Pic Microcontroller. So for, for first of all, we need to click on new project and here we need to write counter underscore zero 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 then next and then finish you you must know that this is a simple counter circuit but it is also known as the night rider or running led project so we will take our microcontroller Okay, so PIC 18F452 is our microcontroller. Okay, on port number D, that is from RD0 to RD7, we will attach our LEDs. So, we will take our green LEDs and we have to yeah, we, we have to attach all the LEDs from RD0 to RD7 and the total of 8 LEDs can be connected with this port that is port D Okay, now we will. Okay, now we will attach one more LED from like uh, up to eight LEDs. So, okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, now we can attach them with D uh, zero, then to D one, then to D two then d3 d4 and d5 and d6 and then d7 so a total number of 8 leds all the negative ends or the cathodes must be common with each other or with connected with each other so that we can give ground on this node and all, all the anodes are connected with the pins of the port D and the cathodes are the and cathodes are connected with the ground so this is our LED section now one more thing that you must have to connect M clear pin or a VPP pin with the VCC take or VCC source because it acts as the enable pin of the microcontroller so this is our no need to attach any sort of oscillator or anything it will work fine without the oscillator so okay now we will uh, go out to our micro C project we will click on file or or we can just delete the this thing okay and we can go to file new new project here standard project we can write here counter and we can change it to 18f 452 and next and finish okay now here we just need to declare the port d as output port so 0x00 must be must be written there what it will do that it will turn that is 0 0 will be sent on the whole port d and then it will turn this port that is port d into the output port and if you want to make it input input port then you can write 0 x ff so now port d is our output port so now 
we will make our while one infinite loop so that our all the instructions within this while one must be repeated again and again so now port d is our output port and we will send binary data on it like 0b so we will write uh, like uh, 0 0 0 0 4 0 then 0 0 0 and then 1 so this is our data that is because our port is 8 bit port so so we just send the 8 bits for that is the the last one is 1 and the rest all are 0 then we need to write delay underscore ms and 1 300 okay so 300 enough so this is our delay time delay of 300 millisecond then we can copy it and we can paste it here first will become 0 then 1 and like this again this delay of 300 okay now, now we can paste all these things here so first port d and then this okay okay now zero and third bit will be one then zero and the fourth bit will be one then 0 and 5th bit will be 1 and 0 1 2 3 4 5 and this 6th bit needs to be 1 ok now 0 then 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so 7 bit must be 1 then we can again copy it and we can write here like this and then 0 and 1 ok now with this we can move our LEDs like running lights ok now we will run this project counter underscore 0 0 yes save ok now we will save we will now generate its hex file so save so i will okay night just i will just write here night so a rider we can also write night riders so we will save it okay now we will go here and double click on the controller then go to the files and then we we must have to select our hex file so where is hex file our night writer dot hex so this is our hex file we will okay now we will run it now you can see that our lights are it's just like the moving light or the night writer so we can even uh, make it fast by reducing the delay that is 300 to 200 or 100 millisecond so hopefully you got the concept so thanks for visiting our channel